Reporting from the newsroom. Reporting from the newsroom. Reporting from the newsroom in Champaign, I'm Emily Thornton, and this is the Daily Line I Vidcast for Thursday, February 28th. Many local businesses are hoping to thrive from unofficial St. Patrick's Day festivities. About 10,000 guests are expected to visit the Champaign-Urbana area. According to Champaign Mayor Don Gerard, the increase in visitors helps to stimulate the community's economy. While some businesses like Benny's Beverage Depot and Fat Sandwich Company expect to increase sales on unofficial, not all businesses benefit from the increased number of visitors. The manager of the Alina Union Hotel says that they spend more money on unofficial weekend for extra cleaning crews and increased security. In preparation for unofficial, university and private certified housing are adjusting their usual guest policies. Just like in previous years, university housing residents will not be allowed to host any guests for the weekend. The same restriction of guests will be in place at Presby Hall, the Newman Center, and the Hendrick House. Residents of Illini Tower, the Armory House, and Bromley Hall will be allowed to have one guest for the weekend. In women's basketball, seniors Carissima Penn and Adrian Godbold will lead the Illini onto the court at Assembly Hall for the final time tonight against Ohio State. Penn and Godbold will be honored after the game. Kirsten Magrum, who was medically disqualified earlier this season after suffering her fourth concussion, will join them. Tonight's game will give the team the opportunity to pick up its 10th Big Ten win, a benchmark that Coach Matt Bolant has previously said would get the Illinois into the NCAA tournament. Make sure to check out today's sports section for a profile of Illini men's hockey goaltender Nick Clark. Clark's 90% save percentage this season has helped the Illini to their third regular season championship in school history. Clark and his team are looking to get a win in the start of the national tournament this weekend in Bensonville. According to the National Weather Service, today we can expect clouds with a high of 36 and a 40% chance of snow. For the Daily Illini, I'm Emily Thornton and this has been the Daily Illini Vidcast.